Um, what are your thoughts in 2014? <laughs> My notes just say, uh, Lewis. So yeah, that wasn't a very good bit. I didn't like that bit. That could have... I wasn't so good. But generally it was a pretty awesome season. It was my favourite season that I've watched and I was just so happy that everything. Oh. How are you surviving the winter break? Well, surviving mentally I'm doing quite well because I've got my sleeping pattern is so much better. There's FE. There's lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of revision to be doing, which I should be doing now. Physically not so well because I've got this awful cold. But... Favourite, least favourite team lineup changes. Well, a lot of the team lineup changes I don't really know a lot about. Just obviously there was Red Bull, but I'm really not happy with my current lineup. You might have seen that. I mean, I really love Jensen and I really love Fernando, but I love Jensen and Kevin together, and I really like saying Kevin. I'm about six. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't really have a favourite because I don't know much about all the other drivers. All the new ones. I don't particularly know much about the ones that were there before. Um, nine. What race are you most excited for? Australia, just to start it all up again. Yeah, I'm not one of those lucky people getting to go to a race. You guys. But yeah, I'm really excited for Australia. Who do you want to see in the top three? There's lots of cutting out on this. I don't know why, because it ended up being the same as what we wanted before. There's Felipe, Massa. Now we've got two. Nasa was in here just because I like the Brazilian national anthem and it would be nice to hear that lots. But he got crossed out. Valtteri, again, just... Okay, the third place ended up going to Jensen, just because you know, it'd be awesome to see him prove himself and it'd be awesome to see a British person do good and for me to not be annoyed by him. The most surprising, um, I've just got the most surprising written down, who's, who's going to be the most surprising driver of the year? Pasta. Pasta's going to do an entire year without crashing and everybody will be shocked, except me, because I just predicted it now. No, on a serious note, I'm not sure, I think, I'm not sure if it'll be surprising, but all the Red Bull boys will do good and everybody will improve themselves. That would be good. I'm not going to do the Create Your Own Team because it will just be Williams. And then I'd have then I'd have a bit of a fit because Susie and I wouldn't be able to cope. So I'm not going to do that, but I think... It's pretty obvious what it would be. 